Hello guys, in this experiment our purpose is to measure speed of light by using the relation between speed, wavelength and frequency of electromagnetic waves. We are going to use a microwave and two reliable detectors. Lavash, chocolate, who wins? Let's begin! While doing this experiment you need to be careful about one point. You shouldn't uh, put any metal in the microwave and you shouldn't put any paper because it can catch a fire. In this experiment we are going to remove rotating dish because it uh, distributes the heat all over the surface so we don't want it. In this experiment we are going to see knots and anti knots on the surface so we are going to use our first detector and my assistant is going to help me. How can I help you sir? Put the detector in the microwave. Yes sir. Now we are going to turn on the microwave for 10 seconds and see the results. Take the lower shower buses. Yes sir. Take it to the measuring table. Sir. Now we are going to measure the distance between two dark spots. Probably you won't be able to see the points from the screen, but I can see them. 6.8 centimeters. Now we are done with the launch and assistant. Move on to the shot. Chat it. Let's go. What are you doing? Did you forget what I said? Oh, sorry, yes, sir. Now, we are going to turn the microwave for 10 seconds and see the results. Take it out. Even though our assistant ate some chocolate, we can still measure the distance. Probably you can see from there, but this is the first point and this is the second point. So distance between them is about 6.5 or 6.6 cm. Assistant, calculation time. Here you go. For Lavash, we got our measurement as uh, 6.8 cm, but it is not our real uh, wavelength since we have standing waves in the microwave. So we need to multiply it uh, with 2 and we get 13.6 cm. We know the frequency as 2.45 uh, MHz uh, and by using the relation we get Give me the calculator. Yes, sir, here you go. Now we got our result approximately 3.3 uh, times 10 to the power 8. Now we are going to calculate it for our second detector, which is chocolate and see which one is more accurate. For chocolate, we got our uh, distance as 6.6 uh, .6 cm which gives us 13.2 uh, cm. We got our wavelength as 13.2 cm and if we do the calculations right now Now we got our speed of light for chocolate as 3.2 times 10 to the power 8 meters per second. So if we compare them, we can clearly see both of them sucks. But chocolate is slightly better detector than Lavash. Now we can clearly see that 
we cannot trust any of them. But we cannot blame our directors. Uh, there is only thing, only person we can blame is my assistant. But uh, in addition, we can blame our microwave system. We, we didn't get frequency more accurately. We got our frequency results uh, from my, our microwave data sheet. In addition, we couldn't identify our spots. Therefore, there must be some huge uh, errors and uncertainty. Now uh, it is time to kick my assistant out. Assistant, you can go. I kick you out. Hello guys. In this experiment, our our purpose is to measure, uh, and we get wavelength as. Uh, to any, I missed that. What happened? How can I help you with your vision? Three point three times ten to the my, ten to the eight. I couldn't speak, and uh, we couldn't see the spot. Uh, as so reliable detectors.